So we were in the big parlor room, and the man had gotten back on the bourbon, and he'd begun, he was begotten with souse. He was beridden with souse. He was soused. He was soused out of his mind. He was got that weeping drunk. At one point, he says, nobody ever really loved him. I was like, you know, I remember before I could talk, I loved you. Once I, you know, once I really realized how stupid the man was, I lost some of the love I had for him. But, you know, it's, you know, I love him in a sense, like a brotherly sense, you know. I used to love the man deeply, but once I got a little smart and I realized all the stupid mistakes he was making, you know, then it, it, the love wanes somewhat. But that's neither here nor there. That's not the thing. The man, he got all weepy, and he looks at me, says, I, I think maybe I was a mistake. And I was like, why? He goes, I think maybe I was a mistake. And I said, what are you talking about? He goes, I don't know. I'm, I look back, and I don't think my mother and father really even loved each other. I don't even, and I looked at him, I said, yes, you were a mistake. It's all a mistake. And the man burst out crying, and he was like weeping, like in the Peanuts characters where their teardrops, his teardrops actually shot upwards and then fell down like a sprinkler. I was like, gosh, am I, this guy's just squishing his eye, tears out. They're shooting out of his eyes. I mean, come on. You got to toughen up a little bit. You know, the man has to, he has to toughen up a little bit. Of course, it's all a mistake. And the man, he kind of he kind of put his hand down in his head, and he was sobbing. He says, no, no, dog. No, there's where you're wrong. It's, it's not a mistake, my friend, because there's a God. And I said, you know what? I think there's probably a God. And the man cut me off. He said, no, there's a God. And I said, well, whatever. The, the dogs get to go to heaven. And the man looked at me. and He kind of got a little weepy again. He says, you know, as far as the Jehovah's Witnesses say, yeah, you don't get to go. I mean, I don't know if I believe that part of it. You know, I probably would say I don't believe that part of it. But I know there's a God. I know there's Jehovah. So it's got to be part of a plan. And I looked at the man. I said, no, he might have set it all in motion. He built it all. But... He's not directing every... And the man looks at me and says, it's, it's up to God to direct your steps. And I looked at him and I said, no. I remember when them Jehovah's Witnesses come over, they said it's not even for man to direct his own steps. It's not for you to direct your own steps. It doesn't say Jehovah's directing you like a robot. So I don't know. And the man was like, I don't know either. And I said, why do you think... Why are you thinking about mistakes? Why, why do you think it might be a mistake? I mean, it's so glorious to be alive. What are you, crazy? Yeah, it's a mistake. It's a gazillion, bazillion, to gazillion to the nth power that you ever arrived here. Go back and count all the sperm that you are related to, you know? I mean, come on, guy. There was like a, you know, hundreds of millions of sperm and the one thing that you, you know, the main sperm that got you. And go back. It was a battle royal among millions of sperm each time. And each time the code came up to you. So how could it be, you know, wrong or bad? And the man is like, ah, I don't know. I'm just having a really crappy time. I'm just, everything seems to be going against me. I just can't stand it anymore. And I, I guess I'm getting frustrated. I got to look up and see the beautiful sky or something. I got to get in the sunshine, you know. And I looked at him. I said, maybe if you cut down on the drinking, you know. But by that time, he was already snoozing. He had already gone back into his, you know, the realm of comatosity. He had come up for with a salient I don't even think it was a salient point that, you know, he's getting to be miserable. But I was like, you got to toughen up. I mean, jeez, come on.